could do up to eight inch trees with this thing. I was sent a super cool saw. Check it out. Ooh, product review time. Any fish yet? Any fish yet? I better get over there and start jigging. Hi everybody, it's a little bit of a chilly one here today in Northern Ontario. I was sent this mini electric chainsaw from Saker. And so we're gonna do a product review today. So yeah, super cool. Pumped to do product review on mini chainsaw. Yes, of course, I love chainsaws. So here it is, the mini electric chainsaw, 780 rotations per minute, guide plate length, 240 millimeters. It's a four inch saw. You got the guard on the top and the hand guard on the bottom. We got to slip the battery in there. It's already charged up. Comes with your charging cord and it specifies right in the manual to not overcharge it because it will shrink your battery life down to a fraction of what it should be. And especially in Ontario, we are, it's cold temperatures, so your batteries will not last as long, right Stitchberry? So it also comes with your chainsaw bar oil. So we're gonna get lubed up. And here's our 20 volt max. Rub it up a bit. Make sure our chain's coated. That should do it. So now every time you use this, this little baby, you're gonna be doing the, the oil on your on your saw blade. Let's take this thing into the bush. On point two with their pricing, totally less than a hundred dollars. You can get it. You can also get the larger kits that have multiple batteries packs, cases and stuff. Sticker mini, twenty volt, point five amp hours. The battery will last about an hour long if we're cutting. Four inch, lightweight, compact, fits right into my backpack, which is bonus. This thing is awesome. I love it. And it matches the color of my snowshoes too. My so. snowshoes. Thanks again, girlfriend. Cool. So that's fun. Handle, everything's really sturdy. It all comes assembled, fully assembled. All you have to do is charge up your battery and you'll know that the battery is charged when the little light turns green. So I think it's awesome. It's got the guard on top and you have the tool, little socket so that you can tighten up your blade. It's loose. You don't want that coming off there, right? So that's to tighten it up. And then you also have this screwdriver here to tighten up your guide and your handle and stuff and if you needed to do repairs you to can. adjust your your bar how tight your chain is right there only thing I could see 
being a little bit difficult if you were like left-handed to use because the buttons are not on the side. Hi! zombies, but... Well balanced. Even with the battery off, it's well balanced. I think one of the most fascinating things is the weight on this. It's one kilogram, so just a few pounds. And obviously it's compact. It can go right into your backpack, your bungo bag. Backpack size. It's awesome, eh? Yeah, it works pretty good. Can't believe how light it is. Oh yeah, what about those people who do all the carvings into like stumps and stuff? I think it'd be awesome. I actually have a friend, Chris. He's a carver. I have to show this to him and see what he thinks. Cause yeah, yeah, you can get uh, pretty, some pretty fine detail into uh, your carvings. Hey, even Gordo does carvings. What do you think, Gord? Good for carvings or what? The denser the wood, the more it's going to take for battery power too. So if you're doing something like a little pine, it's not going to take as much as if you're doing like a birch or a maple. Thicker hardwoods going to use up more juice. To your fishing gear for when you're going ice fishing or even in summer camping gear. And uh, yeah, compact, lightweight, easy to use, has your wrist handle right here so that if you're trying to push down your chin, bam, you like ninja moves. Pick it up. Pick it up. I'll drop the link into the comments and into the description. I cannot get away from this fire smoke. I'm getting all stuffed up. It's just one of those days where the wind is just cycling all around. So yeah, I think it's cool. It's handy for many, many different uses. Super exciting. Love it. Do I recommend it? Absolutely 100%. For less than $100, you can get this item right now. Gear Mini, and they also have different kits as well. So you can get like multiple batteries. Battery lasted in here, and we we're like, what, minus seven today? And the other day was probably about minus five. So the battery lasted like a good hour of just cutting trees and branches and stuff when we were out fishing. And so, I bet you, I bet you I can sell some of these things, honestly, totally. I just need, I need a, a guard, a, a case, a case for it, or even a casing just for the, uh, the chain part. Yeah, totally, and I'm gonna make one. I might actually make one out of birch bark, so. Cool, thank you, Saker, for sending this to me. Super fun. I think everybody should have one of these if you do any type of outdoors, homesteading, lawn care work even for pruning trees this thing come in handy if you go fishing hiking backpacking hunting you name it super handy and 
if you're going out there for a couple of days, you might want to bring a solar charger of sorts. Super cool. Thanks again, Saker. I love it. And it's just my size. Cool. Hey, and yeah, be good for getting kids to learn how to use a chainsaw safely also, right? For people new here, we burn a lot of wood in the wintertime. 12 and 14 cords this year I think we're underneath we're below that this year actually I think we're probably at about 10 11 cords so yeah send a chainsaw cool because I love chainsaws especially the smaller ones that I can I can handle right because I'm just I'm just small like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me Meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free. Well, we know it works to carve. We just have one minor slip up right there. That's cool. I got my own seat. Look, yeah, you were even down right in the weeds. No fish. Oh well. From a distance you can tell. You're staying later. are all snuggled in here. Are you stitchy? This car goes right in there. Our little pregnant mamas. Our little pregnant mamas. Yeah. Yeah! Ryan's first ice fish in like 20 years. Woo! Oh, don't let it flop in the hole. Because that, both those times, it was getting it on the way down. Like exactly, they're going and... for the drop. So keep doing what you're doing, play with it. You only want fish now time. Fishing in 20 years. He's already done. So let's see if we can get a big one. Even a couple of smallies. Can't get him skunked on his first time back. After like 20 years. So in your manual you have different safety instructions information on battery cartridge care assembly well we don't we don't have to assemble it but if you ever had to take the chain off and replace the chain it's in there too instructions on lubrication of your chain and adjusting your chain and maintenance and cleaning the guide bar. Okay, very cool. So, and the specifications, awesome. Not weight, one kilogram. That's key right there. And do not expose to rain. Good point, because your stuff will get rusty. It says, hold the saw with both hands while working. One-handed use is extremely hazardous. Yeah, it's been a while since I did a product review on the channel. I think the last one was Jace, Jace Medical Antibiotic Kit, which is a really good one to get also. And then I think prior to that, it was that solar power radio that Kiana in China had sent me. She's got a channel. So, and then I have a super special one coming up too. And it's not going to be a product that I have to try, but um, it's going to be like more of an unboxing. Yeah, pumping, pumping this, this person's stuff up, honestly. 
cool, super cool, fun. It's gonna be awesome. Looking forward to it. Product review. That's one of the awesome things about having a YouTube channel is when you get sent products and gifts and seeds and new seed swaps and all that fun stuff. It's uh, it's super fun. It makes it uh, enjoyable and rewarding too, right? Because uh, YouTube doesn't pay a whole heck of a lot. Well, I guess some some channels, the bigger channels, are gonna make some money, but yeah. Hey, let's go. You're such a kid. Ah, you're funny. And we are officially getting off the ice, folks. Thank you for watching. Hey. Stitch Berry. Roll out time, kid. You missed all the fun. Sleeping. Pug life. You do this. This is, uh, for me, this is a hobby. Preserving memories and um, just capturing some really cool moments on video and then editing and having that as a legacy. It's, it's super awesome. Want me to review some products? Want us to review some products? Alex is over there listening to music. That's usually what brings the fish in. That's what he thinks anyways. I'd be happy to review your products. Just shoot me an email. No the girl hobbies at Proton Mail. Maybe Rappolo will send me some lures or something. That'd be fun. Oh, and I just placed an order online and I haven't been metal detecting in years. So guess what? That might be a product review. The metal detector. I ordered one. I'm like, yeah, we're going to do it. And we're going to do metal detecting this summer. It's going to be fun. There's going to be a lot of different stuff that I'm covering on the channel this summer. It'll just be gardening and fishing and all that fun stuff. We're going to be doing some metal detecting. Yeah, some relic hunting. Coins. Fun stuff. That's what they're singing. Yeah, so I've been subscribing to a couple other uh, channels, doing all the fun uh, metal detecting and stuff as well, so I'm getting the feel for it, because I haven't done it in many years. I had one and I sold it back in the day. Silly me, but this one I picked up is going to be a little bit higher quality, so. But I will need to buy a shovel, the proper shovel, and I think the pinpointing device, so. Yeah, I'll have to uh, do my research on that stuff, and then we'll see what kind of we can find. I'm hoping for silver coins. It's a brisky one today, folks. Look at that wind's just picking up that fresh snow on the lake. We're kind of tucked in here in a little corner. I'm just getting some sticks and stuff ready to start a fire. Alex is doing the lines. And check this out. Hey, Mac, I know you're picking up cans. It's usually my springtime thing to do too. I'll have a video to roll out about cans soon. But check this out, man. Okay, we got two cans. Mac! Look though! Creamsicle Blast smearing off ice and it's unopened! Score! And wait! Wait! Wait for it! Bush light unopened. Woo! Yeah, I got free drinks, Shug. Good start to a good day of fishing.
Yeah. Western wind today. I don't know, it feels like minus eight. And then the wind chill factor, so it's it's pretty chilly. Stitch and Scarlet stayed at home with the puppies. So we're hoping that uh, we're gonna catch a couple here. Multi-species lake. This is where we came last time and caught that trout and pike. So we've got lake trout, walleye, prickle or pickerel. Wallies, I can hear. Hey, Chance, got a question for you, buddy. If you found this in someone's bunker, would you drink it? It's not bad. It's not too sweet, and it's free. So whoever left it here, thanks. Let's get some fish.